blushing. And if you look at Justin Bieber as a kid and Rain as a kid, they look exactly the same. Because that's supposed to be Scott Disick's son. Yeah, Scott's Disick's son. Yeah. But it doesn't look like Scott. And Scott ah, even... I am 40. Oh, no. I guess... Do you think I look 40? Did you rip it open in the yeah. I thought you just said I'm 26. Yeah, you are 26. Met Justin Bieber at the White House Correspondents' Dinner in Washington, D.C. I think actually before that, I had said in an interview that I wanted to set him up with my sister, uh, Kendall. The way for best for him is to put it back on him yeah. and learn to be accountable. Did you know that Scott recently urged Courtney to undergo a paternity test for their newest child, only to be met with firm refusal? Quite astonishing. Those familiar with the Kardashian clan are likely aware of Scott's persistent doubts regarding the parentage of Courtney Kardashian's third child, Rain. After much speculation, the truth regarding the nine-year-old boy's paternity is emerging. Interestingly, speculation suggests Justin Bieber could potentially be the biological father. Well, while this may seem far-fetched at first glance, considering Justin's connection with the Kardashian family, it's not entirely implausible. But how did this saga unfold? Stay tuned to learn more. It traces back to a seemingly innocuous desire by Kim Kardashian to orchestrate a relationship between her 14-year-old daughter Kendall Jenner and the then 16-year-old Justin. This was part of the Kim and Chris's strategy to elevate Kendall's modeling career and maintain the family's relevance. Kim portrayed it as a casual dating scenario, yet fans saw through the facade, understanding it as part of the family's ongoing strategy to remain in the spotlight. Justin seemingly integrated into the plan, engaging with every member of the Kardashian-Jenner clan, including Kris Jenner. No one was exempt from his charm. It's bewildering when you consider his rumored relationship with Kylie and the suggestive exchanges with someone resembling Kendall. But when it came to Courtney, none could produce a child for him until her turn. At that time, Courtney's relevance waned due to her limited contribution to the show post-breakup with Scott, transitioning into a quieter phase. She faced a need to regain prominence. Enter Justin Bieber, swooping in to revitalize her presence. What's amusing is Justin's awareness of his exploitation, yet his willingness to play the role of a celebrity savior, adding an ironic twist to the situation. Despite the significant age gap of approximately 15 years between Courtney and Justin, the relationship is undeniably one of the most peculiar occurrences in recent memory, showcasing how age is merely a number for these individuals. Well, numerous sources suggested that they had been in communication prior to publicly acknowledging their relationship in October of 2015 their interactions sparked speculation. Courtney was spotted leaving a restaurant in Justin's car having arrived separately and they departed together while the night was still young. Their rendezvous extended to Universal Studios on a Hollywood horror-themed night where they were observed engaging in activities beyond what one would expect from mere friends, with Justin notably holding Courtney's hand throughout. However, when pressed about their relationship in an interview, Justin attempted to downplay it, stating that there was nothing significant between them, despite actions suggesting otherwise. It almost seemed as though Justin played the role of an amiable boyfriend, even even bonding with Courtney's child, until his subsequent relationship with Haley Baldwin made it clear that any association with Courtney was off limits. Justin's close involvement with Courtney's children exceeded expectations, raising eyebrows and prompting speculation. Haley Bieber's strict rule prohibiting Justin from maintaining contact with his ex girlfriends, including Selena Gomez, seemed puzzling in Courtney's case. If Courtney wasn't categorized as an ex girlfriend, why the restriction from Haley? Yet Haley's concerns didn't end there. She worried about Courtney potentially reigniting her connection with Justin after her breakup with her previous boyfriend. Given Justin's apparent fondness for Courtney, it wasn't far-fetched to consider that he might provoke Courtney's ex, Scott Disick, by posting a suggestive photo with a cryptic caption like, Lord knows. This scenario seemed plausible, especially since Scott often refers to himself as the Lord. This explains the intricate web of emotions entangling Scott's disdain for Justin, transcending mere jealousy at witnessing his partner with another man. Indeed, the roots delve deeper, unearthing Scott's latent reservations regarding the timing of the conception of their final offspring. Speculation swirl, suggesting Justin's involvement with Courtney's pregnancy potentially preceding their reconciliation by several months. The burgeoning discourse, particularly on platforms like TikTok, amplifies the plausibility of this conjecture, casting shadows of doubt upon the paternity of the child. Moreover, this specter of Rain's birth looms large in Scott's psyche, representing a harbinger of disquiet he never dared to confront. Upon learning of Courtney's pregnancy, his reaction betrayed not joy, but a palpable discomfort, hinting at unresolved tensions with their relationship. Scott's tepid response stemmed not from indifference, but from an acute awareness of their strange dynamics, 
rendering the prospect of expanding their family a daunting endeavor. His sporadic presence in Courtney's life further muddies the waters, prompting probing questions regarding the true lineage of their offspring. In this multifaceted saga of love, betrayal, and uncertainty, the question persists, whose child truly graces the bonds of their tumultuous union? It appears that Scott's suspicions were not unfounded, as he found himself meticulously calculating the timeline of Rain's conception, ultimately leading to the contemplation of a DNA test. However, Courtney's refusal to acquiesce to his request raised eyebrows and fueled speculation within their social circle. The stark contrast between her compliance during the birth of their first child and her current reluctance only serves to deepen the intrigue surrounding Rain's paternity. The significance of timing looms large in this saga, acting as a revealing beacon amidst the shadows of Dao. With Rain's birth on the 14th of December, simple arithmetic unveils March as the month of conception, aligning with a tumultuous period in Scott and Courtney's relationship. March witnessed Scott grappling with the insidious grip of depression while navigating the turbulent waters of infidelity, further straining his connection with Courtney. Their time together was scant, eclipsed by Scott's emotional turmoil and his dalliances with other women, inadvertently paving the way for Justin to step in the void by his left absence. The convergence of these events casts a pale of skepticism over Courtney and Justin's relationship, inviting speculation and gossip to run rampant once more. The refusal to undergo a DNA test for Rain, coupled with the discordant echoes of their past struggles, serves as a haunting reminder of the fragility of trust and the complexities of love entangled in the web of time. As whispers grow louder and conjecture spirals out of control, the truth remains elusive, shrouded in the fog of uncertainty that envelops Scott and Courtney and Justin in its enigmatic embrace. Even Ellen, with her keen eyes for human dynamics, sense the undercurrents at play in Scott and Courtney's relationship. While time may veil truths, the resemblance between Rain and Justin Bieber's glaring to the testament of a genetic connection that can't be ignored. In stark contrast, Rain bears little resemblance to Scott, prompting questions about the authenticity of Courtney's claims. The stark contrast in Scott's demeanor towards Mason and Penelope, where his paternal instincts shine through, only serves to deepen the mystery surrounding Rain's paternity. What secrets does Courtney harbor, and what is she withholding from those around her? The notion of Justin accepting another man as the father of Courtney's child is a monumental hurdle, laden with complexities and emotional turmoil. It's a revelation that would shake the foundation of their relationship and force them to confront uncomfortable truths. The weight of such a revelation is indeed overwhelming, leaving all parties grappling with the implications of such a revelation. Despite Scott's relentless pursuit of the truth, Courtney remains steadfast in her denial, clinging to the narrative that Rain is indeed his child. Her refusal to confess only adds fuel to the fire of suspicion, leaving Scott frustrated and disillusioned. His attempts to coax the truth from her have been met with obstinate resilience, further eroding the trust that they once had together. Yet amidst the chaos of their fractured relationship, Scott's trust issues loom long large, exacerbated by Courtney's penchant for seeking solace in the arms of other men during their tumultuous moments. The specter of Justin hovers ominously, casting doubt on the nature of their relationship and igniting Scott's imagination with visions of betrayal and deceit. In this labyrinth of emotions and deceit, the truth remains elusive, buried beneath the layers of denial and deception. As Scott grapples with the uncertainty of Rain's paternity and the fragility of his relationship with Courtney, the shadows of doubt continue to loom large, threatening to unravel the delicate tapestry of their lives. Courtney's persistent refusal to undergo paternity test only serves to deepen the quagmire of uncertainty enveloping Scott, leaving him grappling with doubts about the authenticity of their claims. It's a perplexing situation compounded by Courtney's apparent indifference to whether Scott believes her explanation or not, further complicating an already fraught dynamic between them. The internet, as expected, has become the battleground of conflicting opinions, with voices both for and against the notion of Justin Bieber being the father of Rain. On platforms like Twitter, the debate rages on, with users recounting theories and observations that fuel the speculation. One user referencing a TikTok video recounts how they were unable to shake the uncanny resemblance between Rain and Justin Bieber, leading them to entertain the possibility that, that Justin might indeed be the biological father. Such assertions gain traction, taking root in the minds of those who find themselves unable to dismiss the striking parallels between the two. Conversely, there are dissenting voices vehemently denouncing the idea as preposterous and baseless. To them, the suggestion that Justin Bieber fathered Courtney's child is nothing short of absurd, dismissing it as mere gossip and rumor mongering. Their skeptic underscores the polarizing nature of the debate, highlighting the divide between those who entertain the possibility and those who vehemently reject it. Amidst the cacophony of opinions and conjecture, one question lingers. What is the truth? Is the resemblance between Rain and Justin Bieber sufficient evidence to substantiate the claims of paternity, or is it merely a coincidence, amplified by the fervor of speculation? Furthermore, the lingering uncertainty begs another question. Will Courtney ever come clean about the true paternity of Rain? Will she finally put an end to the swirling rumors and speculations? How about you? Do you believe that Justin Bieber is the father of Rain, or do you subscribe to the notion that it's simply a far-fetched conspiracy? Let us know in the comments. That's gonna be all for today, folks. If you want to keep yourself updated on the latest binge-worthy celebrity gossip, click that subscribe button and notification bell for more videos like this.